Cottage Park is in an 1800s rope factory here in the heart of Cottage Park. We are right on the Plymouth Bay Harbor where the historic landmark of the smokestack. So five years ago Bob and I took this 1800s rope factory, we turned it into a winery and decided it'd be a beautiful spot to have a wedding. We also have luxurious grounds where you can have your photos taken out on the boardwalk by the ocean or you can go down by our gazebo that overlooks a beautiful pond where we have some baby swans living there. So welcome to the 1620 Ballroom. This is where we host all of our ceremonies. We can seat up to 200 people in here. And right now, I am standing under the most unique and gorgeous ballroom chandelier. When you look up and see the beautiful chandelier, you're going to see 40-year-old Cabernet Sauvignon wine vines from our vineyard in Napa, California. Now, where you're standing with me is the aisle that you'll walk down. We have Champagne Chivari chairs lined up on either side, and this is where your guests will decide whether they want to be on the left or right, we really don't do assigned seating here. So, but this is your aisle and there's a very dramatic entrance when we pull back the barn doors when the bride comes from behind those barn doors with her escort to the front. And a lot of my brides will opt to rent an arbor. We do have two kinds of arbors. We have the natural brown arbor that is for available to rent for 250 and we have a white birchwood arbor that is available to rent for 350. The other really unique thing about the winery is that it's a blank canvas. So whether you'd like to have a rustic elegant wedding or you want to have an absolute beautiful Cinderella champagne over the top, you can do either or in this space. So now that you're officially Mr. and Mrs., it's time for you to escort your guests to the cocktail party. Here's your big reveal. So welcome to the 1620 bar. This is the hub of your wedding. So this is where we shake all of our cocktails. But most importantly, and what I'm most proud of, is we have six wines behind me that are the 1620 wines that are on tap. The silver taps are our white wines and the copper tops are our red wines. So these are always going to be our most popular wines that are selling to date. Welcome to the 1620 Winery Bell. Now in here, we have our driftwood chandelier and we have all of our wines that are being aged. Only a bride and groom are allowed to come in here to have their photos taken. Because if you book with us, my husband Bob, who is the winemaker here at the 1620, will offer you a complimentary wine tasting so you can decide what wines you'd like to serve at your wedding. So the 72 inch round tables can fit up to 10 to 12 people comfortably. All of your, uh, excuse me, your linens that are white, the tablecloth, the napkins, those are included in your base price package. So as you can see, we set up the tables all around the perimeter. So inevitably, the center of the ballroom becomes your dance floor. There are two important factors to having a phenomenal wedding. Food, that's my job, and music, that's your job. 
No matter whether you pick a DJ or a 12 piece band, we can accommodate that. Here is your dance stand. The largest band I had in this facility to date was 12 pieces. Yes, 12 pieces. So this, as you could see, was blocked off by very large sliding barn doors. And this is also not only where we stage the bride and the entire bridal party to walk down the aisle, this is also available to rent to get ready here with all of your ladies and mothers of the brides. We have a beautiful staging area for the bride that she can use this room throughout the entire wedding for her to just freshen up, put on some new lipstick, or to take a breather. It gets a little overwhelming at times, so we have a nice quiet space for you. In addition to this quiet space, we also like to have a bottle of wine or champagne or whatever you choose to be able to toast with all of your girls before the party starts celebrating. Now, I know you're gonna think I'm crazy because this is a very rustic venue, but my favorite room in this whole place is my ladies' room. Come see. You would think I'm a rustic girl. I'm not, I'm a blingy girl. So I had to put a chandelier in every single stall. Think I'm kidding? Check. Every stall. Now this is the bridal suite stall because you know that it takes at least six girls to try to get the bride's dress up and ready for her to sit and do her thing. <laughs> so, welcome to the bride's throne room. So one of the highlights of your cocktail party is the outside patio. There's been a lot of cornhole tournaments out here. There's been whiskey bars, cigar bars. There's been sparkler send-offs. And this sits right on top of those 1800 railroad tracks, which make the most spectacular photo you could ever want for your wedding.